Yo, what is up guys? It's the Goblin, and today I'm back with another tips and tricks video for Call of Duty Black Ops 3. And in this video, I'm going to be giving you guys a pretty secretive tip. I don't think any big or even medium-sized YouTubers have made a video on this yet. So hopefully this is something that it's kind of an advanced trick. So if you guys are new to Call of Duty, this one um, is going to be kind of hard for you guys to pull off. But this one is something that's pretty cool, and I'll talk about it in a second. But first of all, if you guys are new to my channel, be sure to subscribe. Um, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And also be sure to leave some feedback on this video, a like or a dislike. I think you guys should smash the like button up on this thing because this tip is going to be pretty rare and uh, hopefully you guys will be some of the first to know but if someone has made a video on this um, I apologize because I have not seen it basically what this is and this tip is basically a movement tip into black ops 3 that not many people know and it is basically some people like to call it the G slide it's basically a way to move across the map to dodge gunfights and stuff like that extremely fast and this thing is absolutely insane It's the G slide and basically how I learned about it is from watching some of the the pro or the best free run players and I thought hey would this thing be any good in multiplayer and then I went out and tried it out in some multiplayer and it actually is very effective for rushers and stuff like that and if you're able to pull this off you can get out of tight situations and stuff like that and it is very advanced so I'll go into a uh, I'll cut to the private match of me showing you guys how to do this and I'll kind of explain how the G slide is done all right guys, so here it is me doing it in a private match and I'll show you guys how the G slide is done. So basically what it is, as you guys can see it right here, but a bing, bada boom, I jump and then I slide twice as far. This is extremely useful if you can pull it off. So what it is, it's simply a jump and then a slide. That's how you start to learn to practice. That thing is very easy. And then when you're jump and sliding, you basically have to, when, you're, when your feet are about to touch the ground on the first jump slide, you're gonna start holding the A button or the jump button if you're using the scuff or whatever. Right as your feet are about to touch the ground, you hold that A button and boom, it'll send you flying up as long as you're holding that A button and also holding down on the slide button I think you have to do and it's freaking crazy this thing is very good to do in multiplayer especially on a map like Nuketown if you're rushing with a shotgun and you're trying to get out of spawn quick you're trying to get to the enemy spawn quick this thing is absolutely insane and then another tip I'll show you guys right here this one is a bit more widely known but it's basically when jumping out of a window you don't have to mantle the window you can slide right off of the edge I think t -Mart did make a video on this one but if you guys haven't seen that it's also a very good tip for if you're trying to burst you can do this off of basically any object in the game and it's freaking crazy so hopefully you guys did enjoy this video hopefully this will help you guys with the g slide and this is probably the best tip in black ops 3 so far it's a pretty advanced tip and what i recommend is test this out in a pro in a private match it probably took me about 20 minutes or 30 minutes to keep doing it and now I can pull it off probably maybe 60 or 70 percent of the time but with a bit more practice and probably in a week or two I'll be able to pull off this G slide move a lot more often in the public matches and it's actually good when you guys may think this is not very effective in a public matches but it really is it's good in situations where you're coming up on the bus on Nuketown and you got to get across the map fast you do a quick little G slide boom you're already at the garage and then you just do the final little no boost slide into the garage and it's really hard for people to get shots off on you when they see you do this G slide they're gonna be like holy moly that guy is a freaking bunny and they're not gonna be able to get the good shots off on you and that's basically how I recommend doing this G slide and using it in multiplayer it is pretty effective but it's not you know it's not the most effective thing if you guys can't pull it off so I definitely recommend testing out in private matches and it probably will take you a few days to a week to get it mastered and then once you can do that it will definitely help in your gameplay so hopefully you guys will enjoy this it's a pretty secret tip probably the best simply for the fact that I don't think anyone else has really shared this with you guys on YouTube. Um, I mean, if you guys do do uh, free run, obviously you'd know about the G side. But hope you guys will enjoy this. Drop a like on this thing. Smash that likes up. Th show your friends this tip. Um, see if you or your friends can pull it off better. You can do some pretty nice plays with this G slide for montages and stuff like that. And uh, hopefully you guys will enjoy this. Subscribe for more. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great night. And I'm out. Peace.